It was mind blowing, dude. If you ever, if you guys ever go to Fran to France, a little piece of advice: don't ever separate at all. You will get lost. And keep your shit together. My friend uh, from Colombia lost her phone on the first on the first night. And you lost your souvenirs. And I lost my souvenirs too. Bitch. Yeah, petrol and all this. Huh? Did you lose pictures or did you lose all Oh yeah, I, well, I, I took some photos, but not the best because my phone sucks. But, ah. um, all my memories are in here, dude. They're all in here and they're all in here, too. By the way, I think your friend Kurt, mm -hmm. Kurt's your buddy, right? He should go to France and he should, he should visit TZ. Prayers three times a day. And you don't really pray, pray like you go on your hands and knees there. You sing. You sing for 45 minutes, morning, noon, and night. And it's just amazing. I'll, I'll have to explain more about that in greater deets at some point in time. Oh. When you're talking about how you should be entertaining, there's a video of like... Oh, it's over. <laughs> it's a Jack Scepter kind of video, but... He found this one of a kid, kindergarten news report. Mm hmm. Okay. <laughs> we need to have, we need to have children learn the news. Nope. We mm -hmm. gotta. But it hits funny, I think, you know. Can we add 10 minutes, though? This is, this, is, this is for the tag team championship. Aw, oh, too fast. <laughs> too fast, too furious. Alright there, Vin Diesel. <laughs> Pow! Ooh! Give me a break. Give me a Kit Kat bar. Come on, bitch. Sledgehammer. Bum, bum. Ooh. Slitch him up. Whoa! A big swing, sending Twiggy to the floor. Ooh, shit, man! Junior's back just got whipped. His neck got whipped last by the by the uh, the turnbuckle. Whip! Pow! That bounced onto that sledgehammer. How the hell is Junior able to continue fighting? Okay, that was, that was beautiful. Last month... <laughs> I slapped with my rat. Now I'll kick you my head. Whisper oh. in the wind, connecting on the trigger. One. Oh, come on, give me a break. Last month, we saw Vicious Jeremy defeat AJ Styles, Danny Bryan, and The Undertaker, oh, <laughs> cat cat. All by himself. All by himself, you're right. Because I'm really, you know, I'm missing. <laughs> yes, by the way, we still have no idea what has happened to Player Uno. What we do understand is someone from the audience had said an evil cult uh, had taken him away and uh, and now he, now he, he's nowhere to be found. He's not, he's not in the locker room. We don't know where Uno is. But apparently, FPW officials said that he was disqualified for not participating in the match. Uh, he then, uh, therefore, being eliminated. A little whisper in the wind, this time a little louder. Damn right. Oh! <laughs> Down the crowd and I'm in the jump. Jesus. I think he's I think he's finished. I think he's dead. He's done now. Go with a cover, hook the leg! Oh come on! 
Oh, oh my god. Stand out the back and put in the ball so hard. Uh. <laughs> Jeez, our, our, our overhead camera is phenomenal, but everyone looks so damn small. <laughs> Like, can we please have a close-up shot of somebody, please? Well, maybe the cameraman's uh, stuck in the air. What? what was that? That was fucked up. <laughs> Even this is Jerry just standing there, uncertain of what just happened. Get in a seat. Yeah. Whoa. Take that, Twigger. Where are they going? <laughs> look at look at look at the audience. Look how many people there are here. I can't see. Can we get one camera in the ring and one outside? That'd be super awesome if we can have a split screen right now. A split screen. A split screen. Whoa! We had one moment where we actually had a fucking close up. Where did that camera man go? <laughs> I don't know. He's probably out to lunch. <laughs> a very late lunch. That was one weird angle. <laughs> they couldn't find another cameraman close by. <laughs> like, where the hell is Rodney? Cameraman 2 is not doing his job. That was really Maybe that's just cameraman a fan, like, said, here, have it. some footage. Probably. Okay, meanwhile, Stonewall in the ring. He's got Junior up in the air with a butterfly suplex on the stick of the uh, sledgehammer. That's awesome. And oh. almost a three. If his back had landed on that sledgehammer part, that would have been cat very catastrophe. Catastrophic, excuse me. Catastrophic. Catastrophe. Very catastrophe. Much pain. Many Very catastrophic. I should make a t-shirt. Many losing. <laughs> many losing. <laughs> oh, Jesus. He hit him so hard, he actually went down to one knee. <laughs> Bow and arrow lock. He's trying to snap the twig. Snap that twig. Look at vicious Jeremy mauling on Junior. But now Stonewall's in trouble. Oh! That was smart. Very smart from vicious Jar because he knows that if anything happens, the match could be over, and that means they won't win the belts back. This is all for the Trinidad Tag Team Championship. Aw, oh, heck yeah. Ooh, you almost gave him a call. Oh! <laughs> oh, submission! Could submission! He, could he get out of it? A oh. modified Triforce! Watch out, ref! Oh, fuck, watch out, ref! He's good. We just came close enough to give him a call. Oh, amazing! Just amazing! Oh, there it is, the jumping cutter, the RKO double pin. This is it, and it's all over. That was absolutely picture perfect. Look, look at the height on that move, that butterfly suplex. Twiggy's out already. Punches him, RKO style jumping cutter, and then both father and son with a double pin. Simultaneously, there they are. They had the belts again. A well-deserved victory for the two, the father and son, moving forward in this great sport of ours. Absolutely. And if Player Uno is watching this right now, wherever you are in your little evil cult of yours, beware. Beware. All right, ladies and gentlemen, standing by with our senior correspondent, Ricky Rocker. It is our fourth and final competitor in the main event tonight, ladies and gentlemen, El Guapo and his uh, and his Mexican.